Good evening. It's a lesson in being aware of who's around you. A woman's trip to an Albuquerque ATM almost ended with her being robbed until she stared down the robber. News 13's Chris McKee spoke with a woman who got away, all with her cell phone camera rolling. Chris? Yeah, Dean, Jerry Pohl says even though this robber had a gun pointed on her, she was not going to let herself become another victim. I, I'm, I'm really sick of thugs. She had a gun pointed at her by a robber at an ATM, but walked away unharmed. I'm not going to just easily give up the things that I've worked so hard for. Now Jerry Pohl is telling her story about how being alert kept her from being a victim. That gentleman right there is the guy that was robbing him. The man in the gray sweatshirt, Jerry says, tried to rob her at gunpoint this morning at the busy ATM on the corner of Candelaria and Wyoming. Got a few bucks back, put them in my wallet, and as I'm doing this and waiting for my receipt, I see a car pull up behind me. Jerry says she noticed that driver wasn't parked like everyone else. My second thought was, unless he's here to rob us, and as I turn around, there this guy gets out and he's got a hoodie on and sunglasses and he's got a gun in his hand. She says that awareness prepared her to call out her would-be robber. And a few expletives came out of my mouth and it shocked him because he hadn't said anything to me yet. And I just started to back away. She says the man turned the gun on a guy next to her and she pulled out her phone to record this video. I'm not about to just easily give it up. Not today. <laughs> she ended the video call the cops. by putting a call into police over at the nearby salon. And he jumped in his car and sped off. Hairdresser yeah, Loretta yeah, Steele yeah. saw the end of it and the same hooded man with sunglasses. It's just important to be careful and on the lookout all the time. And Jerry feels the same way. You need to be aware of your surroundings and see when people can come in so that you can prepare and cover yourself. Now, Jerry says she followed the car that the robber was driving for a little while while she was also on the phone with 911 dispatchers, but she says that driver took off near Comanche. Dean. All right, Chris, thank you. Jerry also told us she still has not gotten a call back from Albuquerque police to report that incident.